energy vibration reading for the Capricorn Sun Moon and Rising I want to say to each and every person I'm not having a good day a good hair day I want to say to each and every person thank you for being here thank you for being back this is month of um, June this is the last month of the second quarters and I want to say to each and every person thank you for your likes shares your support and your um, being here thank you welcome all newcomers and I'm um, sorry last month but this month is going to be a much extra um, reading the energy of the month is the energy of the Sun which is wonderful if you're deciding to do something yes go ahead um, the weeks you have four weeks in this month these four weeks you have um, the two first weeks you have the air energy the two second weeks you have the water energy okay so um, this is what you're having and this is going to be good you guys have the energy of temperance and this is good um, um, the universe is asking you to just have um, faith have faith um, temperance is always have faith because you're being protected as the star no matter what is going on around you okay so have some faith let's go and look at what is going to happen for the um, Capricorn Sun Moon and Rising for the month of June so we're calling up in your angels and guides and the universal angels the ascendance masters and the godinas and all the universal angels that protect the Capricorns what is it that is coming out for them in June you have the energy of the Prince of Wands that is coming out in June whoever is this princess of Wands, be careful then you have the energy in the second week the um, the king of cups um, this is someone um, uh, 45 and older uh, it could be 40 and older but the king of cups is coming and in the third week you have the energy of the queen of cups so you have the king of cups and the queen of cups that you have to be dealing with and then in the last week you have the energy of uh, the Empress so this is going to be good this is going to be wonderful so um, in the last week you're going to have your own energy vibration which is wonderful okay so the last week for you guys is going to be powerful um, this month is more of a fire month it is more of productive month of working hard um, but what we're seeing for you guys is that you have um, to deal with a lot of people but um, at the end of the day the last week of June is going to be a very very positive energy so let's see what is the situation with um, the um, princess of cups which is someone 25 between the ages of 25 and 45 it can be a man and a woman but this is coming up with a female energy and it has to do with the um, Knight of Pentacles okay it has to do with the Knight of Pentacles so um, this could be a situation if you are married if you are married to um, someone who is a um, Pisces cancer or a scorpion and you have kids that is an Aries Leo or a Sagittarian or um, um, or a um, Taurus Virgo or a Capricorn um, this is what you're seeing happening and this is what you're seeing transpire here um, there could be a situation that is happening that you have to um, you know find inner strength and balance out the situation middle of the month you have the energy of um, the, the 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 Pisces cancer or scorpion uh, um, over the ages of um, 40 45 and you have the seven of swords you have the seven of swords be careful with these people whoever is the speak these people it can affect you that it could be your partner it could be um, your wife or husband or it could be someone um, people we are not aware of um, but these people seven of swords meaning that they're trying to get away with something the seven of swords meaning that they're trying to get away with something so be careful in the two the, the second week and the third week whoever that's the Pisces cancer or scorpion um, be, be careful of who these people are because they're trying to get get away with something okay let's see what is happening with the Queen of Cups and the Empress um, there is going to be a judgment there is going to be a judgment um, whoever the Queen of Cups is um, this could be a family member it could be a sister or cousin or that sort of a thing or um, and it could be also that this lady is a, 
um, going to help you to bring in your financial um, abundance that mean you whatever you need um, to to, um, to survive this um, Queen of Cups is going to help you um, to bring it in okay so let's look and see what is this Prince which is this Taurus Virgo or Capricorn this could be some of you children but it could be someone of a family or someone that is trying to get away with something what is he trying to get away with the eight of um, Pentacles it's as if um, there your work be careful um, you people whatever you're doing be careful um, what you do because people could be trying to steal your work um, you need to be careful because whoever this Prince of Pentacles is he's going to try to steal something that you have work on so be aware of this person um, and and um, whatever the situation is because you're having this King of Cups and this Prince of Cups and whatever is happening they're trying to steal something and this has to do with your work so be careful let's see what is going to be this judgment call that is going to be coming out the energy of the magician is as if you are going to find out that this person try um, to steal your work and to um, do as if it's their work okay I'm um, I'm gonna ask again but let's see what is going to be the outcomes for you guys what is going to be the outcomes for the month of June for you um, you have the energy of the ten of swords okay so obviously someone is going to try to steal something so let's ask and see what is this person what is this um, a Prince of Pentacles is going to try and steal because um, he's going to be caught. He's going to be caught. Not to worry. What is this Prince of Pentacles trying to steal? Information. It's as if he's blocking some information that is supposed to. He's stealing a letter or something. So be aware. Um, the, the, this, this, um, whoever this. Uh, Prince of Pentacles is, is trying to steal a letter um, you are going to receive the message about it you're going to know that this person did it you are going to be you, you're going to know that this person did it okay because here it is that this whoever this Prince of Pentacles is um, he's going to try and steal some information a block he's gonna try and steal this information and you are going to receive this message that this person try and steal the information okay so um, be aware of what is happening be aware of what is transpiring because there are some really sick people in this world and I'm um, I'm, I'm seeing this more and more and more that um, these people so whoever it is whoever is this um, a knight of Pentacles because he's trying to steal some information so be careful of the people who um, your post box your mailbox your email your computer be careful in the month of June because there's obviously someone who's living in your apartment building who is trying to steal information and steal information that is coming in your mailbox so be aware of this I'm getting mailbox it could be that he's stealing from somewhere else so the outcomes of this week is um, is going to be positive because you're going to be seeing um, whatever the situation is and that sort of a thing you're going to be seeing this coming out and um, you need to be aware of these people because whoever these people are they're trying to steal something let's look at um, the energy um, for uh, the king of uh, let's try to see what is happening um, for this um, um, for the men over the age of 45 in work or as if you're at home you have the energy of the Queen of Swords so obviously there is someone that you have to deal with at work that has to do with the Queen of Swords whoever this person is um, you need to be aware of this person I really don't like the air sign people I'm sorry um, and it's a karmatic situation the wheel is coming in your favor that means uh, um, whatever that is told uh, what was taken is going to be returning and we have the energy of uh, um, the knight of ones with love so um, be careful um, for this knight of ones because he's trying to get away with something do not let him get away with it um, so um, ask the universal angels whoever is trying to steal something from you um, this is someone 
who is between the ages of 25 and 45 and um, that is trying to steal information from you um, and you know ask the universe to make sure that he's he's been caught with this we're looking at the ladies at work there is going to be conflicts whatever the situation is for you ladies at work it's going to be um, a lot of conflicts okay um, let's see what else is happening for the ladies of work you're going to have conflicts in your money situation what is going to be happening you have to deal with the king of swords some of you have to deal with the king of swords with money situation whatever the situation is that has to do with money um, some of you have to deal with the king of swords this is not a very nice energy these are not very nice people that you have to deal with in the month of June outcomes with love your um, wishes and dreams are going to be coming true in the love area okay so some of you are going to be feeling very very happy um, some of you uh, are going to be feeling happy in your marriage in your relationship and that sort of a thing some of you are going to be extremely extremely happy as we move on we're looking at the people 25 years um, the people who are 25 years and older whatever the situation that is coming out you're going to feel happy at your work you're going to finally um, realize that you're at the right place at the right time so you are going to be um, feeling happy at your work and realizing that you're at the right place at the right time mm. then we have the energy um, of money that is coming out you're going to be balancing out your financial situation whatever is happening you have to be balancing out your financial situation as we move forward and we are looking at love for people new love is coming in there is a message of um, new love that is going to be coming in for you so this is going to be good whatever the situation is you're going to be seeing that these situations are going to be clearing up so let's look at the kids 15 until 25 what is happening for you um, with work and that sort of a situation you are going to be victorious whatever the situation that has happening with you kids you're going to be victorious okay a victory is coming in um, you are going to use your words um, um, to um, get through in a lot of things okay the intellect to the intellect you're going to use your intellect then there is a message that is coming in um, with your money so um, your parents are going to let you know that you are going to receive extra money and then we are going to be having the two of ones the two of ones is um, a new um, a new um, offer is coming in and this is good so um, you Capricorns there's a lot of newness that is coming in um, you have the eight of Pentacles there is no other um, sort of a thing you're working with a lot of people uh, ten of swords and that sort of a thing um, whatever that is transpiring and that sort of a thing you are going to um, be seeing this coming out okay as we move forward and we look at the energies of the zodiac as we move forward and look at the energies of the zodiac um, for the Sun people we have the energy of your own Capricorn isn't this wonderful so for the people who were born 12 a.m. to 7 p.m. you have your own energy coming in um, the energy of the Capricorn you're going to be feeling um, strong and you have the energy of the Gemini's you have the energy of the Gemini's okay um, some of the Gemini's can be nice if you can deal with them some of the Gemini's are nice then as we move forward and we look at the energy of the moon energy um, we have Saturn it's so for the people who were born after 7 p.m. oh my gosh expect something to leave your life expect something to leave your life whatever is happening expect something to leave your life in the month of June and then you have Neptune um, your intuition is going to be extremely high you're going to be working with an unseen world and this is going to be extremely positive so um, it's as if if you're you were blocked if you have felt block with uh, your intuition and that sort of a thing um, it's going to be lifted it's going to be lifted if um, negative energies people were blocked blocking you in June um, it's going to be lifted because you're seeing now positive energy so let's see um, what is going to be the outcomes of uh, um, the second half of your reading the outcomes is going to be you are going to be the star okay you are going to be the star there is invitation that is going to be coming in you're going to be the star of 
um, this month okay so whatever the situation be aware um, some of you who are between the ages of 25 and 45 be aware that the prince that's uh, that someone who is an Aries Leo or Sagittarius is going to want to steal something from you be aware of this thing because it's as if it's someone who is close to you or someone who's going to befriend you or someone who lives in your neighborhood or someone who live in your apartment building be aware of this because this person has been um, um you know um checking out when you're there when you're not there going through your post box and that sort of a thing so be aware of that okay um i want to say to each and every person out there um you know whatever the situation is your financial situation is going to be good not to worry because someone is um, I'm, I'm, I'm receiving the feeling that someone is going in your house if they're not going in your apartment um, they're watching you or um, you know your house or whatever they are watching you to see whatever you're doing there's a lot of people um, who are um, you know trying to take things from you there is a lot of people that are working against you but this is going to come to an end and you're going to come out the energy of the star I want to say to each and every person I'm wishing you a wonderful month namaste until next time